Hello everybody, my name is Terry Teo and welcome to Terry Teo's Tech Tutorials. In this video, I will be sharing with you some tips on selling things on Carousel. The first thing a lot of people forget when it comes to Carousel listings is that your photos must be good. This is one of my older listings. As you can see, the photo is very bad. So I've taken some new photos of this bag and I'm going to update the listing with more pictures. It's important to make sure that your items are shot against a good backdrop, are at the center of attention and all in good lighting. If you can, it might be good to include more pictures from many different angles. Like they say, if you got it, flaunt it. With those nicer photos, I'm sure someone will ask about the bag soon. Oh, another tip that I have is that you know if you have older listings that aren't selling and it's been quite some time since you listed them, sometimes it's worth considering lowering the prices. When you lower the price, buyers who have liked the items will be notified. This can be a good way of getting that extra visibility. Normally, people will try and niggle with you on carousel. So when you lower the price, it might be good to give yourself some wiggle room. This wiggle room will also serve dual purpose and let you lower the price every now and then to attract some new buyers. Now, I also have some general tips on fresh listings. See, buyers won't look at your title for more than 3 seconds, right? So you need to make sure your title is short, clear and concise. So for this, I think I will put... Mm, You want something that will get people's attention at the first glance. So when you get to the description, right, you need to make sure that you give the good details like the size and the color. Oh, also make sure to be very honest about the item's condition. When people are buying second-hand items, sometimes they want to know about the story, you know, what makes the item memorable. So make it memorable. This cute bag. And since it's second-hand, it might be good to let people know what the reasons for selling it are. Sometimes it's hard to figure out the perfect description. So take your time. Ah, must be from a buyer. No. And that's all for today. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to like and subscribe. This is Terry Teo signing off. Terry Teo's Tech Tutorials.